I just wanted to go over with the hair products that I use. I wanted to show you guys what I use and I guess how I use them. I usually stick with the same shampoo and conditioner. I have two favorites that I like to switch in and out because your hair do get used to using the same product after a while. So every month I like to switch it up. And my favorite, um, I don't know, I'm sure you've seen if you read beauty blogs, um, it's Shiseido's Tsubaki um, shampoo and conditioner. And so this one is made by Shiseido. I don't know if you've heard of it, but it's a Japanese company that makes all kinds of products, beauty products and healthcare products. And Tsubaki basically means it's a flower. Uh, is it Camilla flower? I have to look that up. I think so. But it's been the essence, the extract oil from the flower. It's really great for your hair. It um, it just it's been used um, since like Geisha times and back back in a era. Geisha would apply um, Tsubaki oil onto their hair when they're styling and it looks very glossy and smooth and it's known to have a repair, repairing, um, I guess, uh, well this one contains Tsubaki amino, um, but it, it, it has like a repairing properties, so a lot of Japanese hair products such as even like Paruti which is a Japanese hair dye contain um, comes with like tsubaki oil conditioner so a lot of ja Japanese products use tsubaki oil which I think it works really nice and the second one I switch up is this one's kind of dirty but it's essential by Kao which is another large um, healthcare beauty product um, company and I usually like Shiseido and Kao products because they seem to work really well with my hair. And so that's the shampoo and conditioner I switch up. And I think the white one works best for like people that color their hair a lot like myself. Um, it has it's extra rich. Um, and then the orange one for colored hair as well because it's it's supposed to be for damage care damaged hair, colored hair, so it's more towards um, heavier and great for colored hair. And then I try to do hair mask every week or every other week. It's I try I want to do like every 3 days, but I get kind of lazy, but it's I try to do hair mask every week. And right now I'm using the Essential um, Hair Pack in orange, which is, well they have two types. They have the pink one, which is the lighter. You can see it right there. And then this one is rich from here. So right now I'm testing out this one to see how it is. I, I really like it so far. Um, it keeps my hair really moisturized and I usually get flyaways and frizzy hair and it seems like every time I do my hair pack with this my hair seems to be more moist and um, tamed and if you look at it it's really thick I think it's great because hair masks should be thick so that you know it stays on and when I do hair masks, I try to, you know, wash your hair, drain your hair, like squeeze all the, the unnecessary water out of it because the more um, your hair is dry, the more likely you're going to get the hair mask on your hair and you don't have to use it as much either. And it's like you're more concentrated. So I squeeze out the water out, I apply it, and then put my hair in a bun. And I, I leave it on for about a good 3-4 minutes. Uh, in the direction, I think you're supposed to leave it on 3-5 to five minutes or so. So yeah, I'm going to test out the pink one and see what's the difference between them. So, so 
So this is a hair um, treatment that I've been using. Um, I got it like three weeks ago from Sasa.com. Create seed. It contained Tsubaki oil again, and in on the bottle it said Tsuya and Matomari, which means Tsuya is shine. Matomari is it will um it will make your hair more wooly, um more together and smooth. Okay, and then on the bottom it said Tsubaki. Pasatsuki tsuya no nai kami ni. So it's for people with fly away and people without shine. And right now I'm wearing it and I think it does make my hair really shiny and um, healthy looking. And you don't see any flyaways either when you apply this. And I think it works good so far. I mean, I, I don't, I want to review this right after I use it for a while. And it's supposed to um, heal your, it has property to heal your hair um, from sp split ends or prevent from split ends. Um, so I'm going to review this. So far it's good. It's in a cream, it's in a light clean, cream, um, it's kind of runny. And at first, I thought it was really oily on my hair, um, but after it really seeps, seeps into your hair, it's not oily at all when you touch it, but it, it feels really oily in the beginning. And if you do put a lot, it does seem to weight down your hair. Um, so I've been using this right after I take shower when my hair is semi-dry. And it seems to like my ends. I try to concentrate on the ends. So it seems to do good. Keeps my hair from looking dry. So I like it so far. And then I used this Chi um, Keratin Mist before I used um, styling product um, because I use straighteners. So this seems to make my hair really shiny and it feels after I use it and I apply um, hair straightener my hair feels thick like when you color your hair a lot your hair seems to like feel fragile and like stringy and so when I apply this I feel like my hair feels thicker and more shinier too and I feel like it protects my hair as well and then, so those are my hair products that I use often and been testing because I like to test things. But when you when I test things, I like to try for about three weeks to a month to decide what if I like it or not because you know you never know initial reaction and after effects. And then another thing that I use, I get asked about what kind of hair straightener I use. I was using <coughs> Chi Nano. This one has been good to me for about three years. This is three years old. It still looks brand new. Um, and this one's, um, when it came out, it was like $195 and I think you could get it for $99 now. And the new one has like a little digital meter. This one is like the first generation, um, but basically this is nanotechnology silver um, ceramic plate, which is, it creates uh, negative ions and kills off germs. Um, so it's supposed to help your hair be a little bit more healthy, I guess, instead of just damaging your hair. And I think it works great. I, I love it. It creates a really good effect. Um, and so that's the hair straightener I've been using. I, if you are going to go with mid-grade um, and spend a $100 on a hair straightener, I would highly recommend this. Um, I think it's better than regular um, Chi, the black ones or the colored ones. I would go for the Nano. 
and then recently I got a new hair new hair stri straightener that I've been eyeing for about a year now. Yeah. And the reason I wanted this straightener is mainly because it's pink and I read so much rave and great reviews on it and it's the GHD um, pink styler this one is a 2009 um, limited edition breast cancer awareness um, pink limited edition box set pink GHD 4 styler set that I've been lusting for basically and on Sephora I'm pretty excited to to test this out well I already did test it out I straightened my hair today with this um, straightener and so far I I'm happy with it I'm not super impressed with it yet because I haven't really tested out I just feel like my chi does a pretty equivalent job so far and you could see side by side they're about the same size and but this one's so much prettier and it's supposed to what I read on the review is that no matter what kind of humidity or what kind of weather you're at your hair after you style with this it's supposed to stay like that and I, I read that it's supposed to keep your hair from damaging from damaging effect from the hair styler but instead it's supposed to keep your hair healthy so that was the two reason I wanted to try it and of course it's pink <laughs> and they just came out with a new 2010 styler pink limited edition styler which one is all white and it has a pink um, ceramic plate and it has like a little design on it and I thought it was cute but I want it all pink so I'm going to test that out and review it later on so I think I mumbled too much so I'm going to let you guys go and I hope um, you could see the dye job which is um, it's really good dye and you can see why it's my favorite um, but I do recommend to read the direction as always it's good to follow direction when you get a new product or beauty product you should always read the direction and if you have questions on how to do it or any specific question you have regarding to the hair dye process you could always ask me and so that was it I hope I covered everything and see you again. So, bye!